Hey guys, welcome to my channel. My name is Kelsey. Thank you so much for joining me today. My cat's like rustling in some Target bags. Trolley! Today, I'm gonna show you how I took these pants. And turn them into these shorts. This is, this was like an extreme experiment. I've never made shorts from pants before. And it was, it was a doozy. It was fun. And I love them. But uh, it was a bit of an experiment. So we'll just jump on in and I'll show you how I came up with these little shorts. So here they are. I am pleasantly surprised, pleased with these shorts. I am like, uh, I enjoy shorts because they're not pants. And so in the summer, it's nice because they're not hot. But the fit of shorts are like the worst thing on earth. Like they're terrible for some reason. And now my dog is drinking very loudly. So I thought if I could turn some pants that I enjoyed into shorts, what could go wrong? So, I mean, nothing really went wrong, but it was definitely a learning experience. So I started with the, nope, I started with these. I started with these black skinny jeans from Old Navy. These were an old pair of jeans that I had laying around that had a hole in them. So I often get rips in the legs of my pants, like in the thigh area on pants that are like really stretchy or kind of cheap. Um, I guess it's just my thighs rub or something. And so they always rip. And this last pair, I felt like they were still in pretty good condition besides the like rip in the thigh. So I thought, I love the fit of these shorts, or of the pants. Let's turn them into shorts. And so I cut them off and then frayed the bottom. And I really enjoy them. They're not like ultra frayed or distressed. It's just right on the edge. There's a nice, a nice little fray and I'm a fan of it. Now that process was pretty daunting. So I cut the shorts to essentially the length that I wanted. And then I went in with a seam ripper and just started ripping the seams going like that run this way, sorry, that run like across the pant. And then I would take the seam ripper and kind of just like pull out the little furs that were left of the seams going this way. So then the seams that were going this way would stay, which leads to the fraying. And uh, that took way longer than I thought it would. Like I sat down one afternoon and I was like, I'm gonna knock these pants out. I'm gonna turn these into shorts. I've got about an hour, let's do it. I knew. It took me, it took me like three days. But I like them. I did wear these, actually I wore these today. Just with a white tee and I really enjoy them. I think this was the first time I wore these ones. Yeah, and this is my second wash, by the way. So the more you wash them, or maybe not the more, but like the first time or second time, I've heard people say that you wanna wash them twice before wearing to get like the ultra distressed look. And uh, I have to agree, when I first finished them, they looked a little like raw on the edges. It was kinda like too perfect. And so after washing, they're really nice and frayed and look like they were just meant to be that way. Now the other pair, these are a pair of thrifted jeans that I had picked up. They're Wranglers and I just love the little like leather patch detail. And I enjoy the color of these jeans. I thought they'd be really cool to do something with. So I ended up making shorts with them. And so my initial plan was to cut them off and then roll them, like, like cuff them and that was not a good look. They were like a little too tight on my legs and then the cuffing just made them like cut into my thighs and it wasn't so cute. So then I decided let's just go for a pair of distressed shorts. So I ended up cutting them a little bit shorter and these are still like, they're not ultra short. They're, they're almost like fingertip-ish, 
maybe a little shorter than that. But they're definitely not like booty shorts or anything, which I appreciate. I cut them and then I honestly, at first I started fraying the edges like I had done on these ones. And I did not like that look. I wanted more of like the distressed look like this. So honestly, I just cut them and did nothing. Like I didn't even try to like distress them at all. I just left them as is. And then I went in to some of the little cuts that you see here. So I've got one going this way on this leg and a little bit up here on the pocket. And then kind of a similar thing on this side, but I've got a bigger one over here with still some jean running through, a little one here, and then I did a little one on this back pocket. Now this was so time consuming, again. So essentially what you did was take scissors and cut like slits across your denim this way and trying to only cut the jeans that were running up and down. You don't really wanna cut too much of the threads running this way. And then, so you have to have at least two of those. So like this one, there was a slit on the top, a slit on the bottom, or like maybe this is easier to see. Slit on the top, slit on the bottom, and then you just had to pick out the little pieces of denim that were left in for each one of those little cuts. And so it was very time consuming, but I love these. Like these are my new favorite shorts. I have worn these a few times already. And after the first wash, they were looking real nice and like the distressing was really coming across nice. And I wore them a few times and then I just took them out of the dryer because they were washed a second time and I think they're even better. Like they look more worn in and that is the look I'm going for. I'm loving this. I'm so happy I turned both of these into shorts. I don't have a ton of shorts because like I said, they're just so annoying for some reason. And so in the summer, my go-to is usually a dress. But I can't usually work in a dress um, because I'm moving a lot and standing and bending and so a dress is just like kind of a mess. And so I'm very happy with two new pairs of shorts that were essentially free. Well, these were like essentially free. These ones I paid like $4.50 at the thrift store and then converted them, which I was at the thrift store the other day for another video that I posted on Monday. I was trying to recreate an Urban Outfitters outfit at the thrift store. Needless to say, it didn't work out as I had hoped, but I was looking at shorts there and the shorts were kind of expensive and all of them were literally booty shorts. Like I was looking through the shorts and I was like, girls, who, who wears all these shorts? I can't wear those shorts. If you can, props to you. I mean, I guess I could, but I don't feel comfortable in them. So this is like a great length. Anyways, <laughs> that was really random. So, I hope you enjoyed this little bonus video this week. I had a really fun time doing this. I'd love to hear about any time that you like converted some clothes into something else. Whether it was jeans to shorts or a jacket to a vest, anything. I think DIY clothes is super fun, so I'd love to hear about it. Anyways, again, thank you so much for spending some time with me today. I hope you have a wonderful rest of your week, and until next time, bye guys. <laughs>